I was in Kazakhstan uh, four years before and I started to research about the very interesting Kazakh um, owl culture, the owls. It's very interesting for me because the owls in Kazakhstan are very similar like the Hungarian villages in the Great Hungarian Plan, the Alford, the Alford region. Because the Kazakhs and the Hungarians also lived together with uh, their animals, horses, cattle, um, sheep. In Kazakhstan and in Hungary and also it's very very similar and the picture of the owl or the picture of a Hungarian village is very similar and I would like to research that that topic how can uh, leave the animals and the peoples together in a, in this the same uh, territory in a village because uh, nowadays a city is just for people and just for uh, cars but originally the the settings settlements of the the people is for uh, animals and for people also and i can see in kazakhstan it's a very traditional and very they they have a very good system to live animals and the people together in the owls and it's very interesting for me and I would like to, to make a research about this. I know not every Kazakh owl is owl, because there are sofhoses and kolhoz on the owl, I think it's different. For example, the system of the streets. Because uh, if you are in a Kazakh owl, and you are inside in a uy, in a house, and you go outside, you say na ulica. I go to, na, to the street after the house. You don't have uh, uh, a place between the house and the street like in Hungary. In Kazakhstan you, you go out from the house to the street. Everything is on the street and uh, in outside now ulica, now on the street, uh, that's a very interesting place for uh, animals and for, for the people also. They use it, everybody, go everywhere. And the, the territory of the family is just the house. And in Hungary, not, not nowadays, some uh, some years before, it was also this. Uh, the Hungarians and in the peoples in the Kunshak kept a lot of uh, cattle, for example. And every day the cattle uh, move out from the village and move in from the village in everywhere.